Tonight at 11, a community in Cleveland is taking steps to stop a growing trend. The group wants gun violence to come to an end. Now, according to Cleveland police, there have been 81 homicides reported from the start of the year to the beginning of August. All week, we've been bringing you in-depth coverage here on News 5 on the state of the city and the violence. City leaders say we're trending in the right direction, but more work still needs to be done. News 5 anchor Delon Dillard joined a group on a walk tonight, hoping to pave the way for a solution. Speaking with me inside the four walls of Trinity Outreach Ministries at 71st and Woodland, Dr. Andrew Clark says his ministry is not limited to the sanctuary. Our push is always outside of the four walls of the church. And Friday night, he plans to push away violence. Many of the crime scenes we've reported on lately, including some this week alone, have created a sense of fear in the community. Clark and the Federation of Network Ministries are fighting against it. Today, there seem to be a uh, a type of mood in the city that, uh, wow, we're, we're in war. Uh, left and right, from the young to the old are being shot down. Clark, along with other ministers, are marching from 71st in Woodward to 55th in Woodward, calling for an end to so much of this violence and calling people that they encounter during their walk closer to God. He says it's their 10th year doing this. I believe someone is gonna change their hearts tonight. Someone watching us and seeing us and, and viewing us is going to change their heart tonight in terms of uh, you know, doing something reckless. Uh, we have found statistically when we've done these marches throughout the, throughout the years, we have found a slight decrease in crime that day because people are focused on love, they're focused on peace, they're focused on making the right choices. This violence is affecting everyone, young and old. I am facing families and children on an ongoing basis who's dealing with stress and conflict and uh, just a number of factors that's impacting their lives. Which is why this organization is hopeful this walk will change not only neighborhoods, but the lives that they touch along the way. Uh, with the help of uh, men's mentorship, church and ministry, we can allow these, these youth and the opportunity to uh, uh, have mentorship where we can guide them. In Cleveland, Delon Dillard, News 5.